The Voyager 1 probe is still exploring interstellar space, 45 years after launch, but it has run into a problem that has the spacecraft's crew on Earth baffled. The Voyager 1 mission launched in 1977, then it entered what scientists call interstellar space in 2012, and has just kept going. But while the Voyager 1 is still operational, scientists on the expedition recently noted that it seemed confused about its location in space without entering safe mode or raising an alert. The attitude articulation and control system readouts, which govern the spacecraft's orientation in space, do not match what Voyager is really doing. The attitude articulation and control system, or AACS, ensures that the Voyager's high gain antenna remains oriented at Earth so that data may be sent back to NASA. Because of Voyager's interstellar position, light takes 20 hours and 33 minutes to travel one way. Therefore, a single transmission between NASA and Voyager takes two days. The signal from Voyager is as powerful as it always has been, indicating that the antenna is still pointing at Earth. The team is attempting to discover whether the inaccurate data is being generated by this instrument or by another system. If the team cannot uncover the source of the problem, they may simply adjust to it if they can. The problem may be resolved by making a software update or relying on a redundant hardware system. Voyager has previously depended on backup systems to survive this long. The probe-fired thrusters used during its initial planetary contacts in the 1970s, in 2017, and they still operated after sitting idle for 37 years. According to NASA, the twin Voyager 2 probe, which was launched in 1977, is behaving properly. The power the twin spacecraft can generate is constantly decreasing, and mission team members have shut off several components to preserve power, moves they believe will keep the probes operational until at least 2025. So stay tuned for any mission updates. Thanks for watching.